Round number one, our no second way, fight in the eight-man eliminator. Daniel Chen, Honor Martial Arts versus Stephen Morales at Braveheart Muay Thai. Love a good southpaw. Strong, strong, strong shots from Daniel. Um, what? Not as much of that Thai style there. It's very, it's more pushing forward, aggressive. Yep. Yeah, we're really seeing Daniel uh, looking to do a bit of damage early, yeah. isn't he? Very, very stiff though. Spends a bit of time on the weights, I think. Yeah, he's a big build. Yes. The south bad side effect of having muscle is you gas out easier. Yep. There's nice clinch here. You don't traditionally see someone throwing switch left body kicks at a southpaw. That's what you see, that yeah, right, right body. Yep, beautiful. Looks like that could be the game plan from Steven, throwing the right body kick and then into the clinch. Yep. Daniel Chen has that aggression though, which, which allows you to guess an opponent out. Mm -hmm. Pushing yeah. forward, yeah, it is that again. kind of stuff. Yep, just as you said it. It's hard to deal with. Knee exchanges here. Yeah, you've got the blue corner really calling for, uh, for Daniel there to put That's that pressure those on. Those big slapping knees there from Daniel, uh, from, sorry, Stephen. Walk forward. You'll see that Stephen had very good defense on the back foot while Daniel came running at him with the hands and he managed to score the knees and nothing actually hurt him on the way in. I think if they stick to the exchanging of, of the, the, the long weapons, Daniel has the upper hand there. Stephen definitely out clinching. Yeah. Big rear knee there on the way in. Very settled is Steven. Once again, big knee. Yes, he wore a hand, but the knee's a big scoring shot. Yeah, yeah Steven may be displaying a little bit more of that uh, that nice tie style. Yeah, and another knee. When you've got a people wanting to come forward, this is what they got to watch out for. Yeah. Getting hit with knees. You know, it's worth noting if uh, you got um, people joining us on the live stream. Uh, if, if perhaps you were an MMA fan or even a kickboxing fan, you would be thinking, oh, the, you know, the aggression is good, the aggression is what's good in this fight, but thinking that's not the case in Muay Thai. No, for sure. There was almost a, there was almost a knockdown there with a, net, with, a, with a right hand. Daniel wore a right hand there. But yeah, as you said, aggression doesn't score. You can go backwards, running away backwards and scoring, and, and you can win. Yep. And that's you know, one of those great intricacies of Muay Thai. For sure. Very nice round from both boys, but it was really those knees from Steven that set it apart. Yes, very I solid knees. Yeah, really nice. All it takes is to get a little bit tired, where you start puffing and you're not breathing at the right times. Yep. You, you're taking in breath and you get kneed at the same time, you generally fold. We saw that in the um, heavyweight fight earlier. We did, we did. It was those knees from Gunn that really solidified yep. it for him. He, he, um, Gunn got dropped, got tired, boom, throws a knee yeah. as, as you're puffing. Number two. Let's see if there's a bit of a change in plan or if both boys are sticking to the same strategy. Daniel's a, to, uh, be pretty happy with what he was doing in the first round and certainly that walk forward, yeah. keep the aggression on. And I'm, I'm believing, I believe Steve will just be a Moy Cal fighter, just knee, knee, knee. Definitely be his best option. We're in a punch, right not quite hitting the knee. In that aggressive closing of the gap from Daniel, he's yeah. much stronger in the clinch this time. And goes for the turn. Locks it off, does Steven. Now that big rear knee. Very nice. It shows Daniel has very good conditioning. They haven't bothered him. There's no wincing, there's no there's no running away from it. No. Wear it and step forward. Both boys ended up on the mat. 
quickly back to their feet. We've got a bit of blood. Yeah, another blood nose. A lot of blood noses yeah. so far yeah. today. Looks like the pace has slowed off slightly it this has, round. Yeah. See, Daniel wants to swing at the head while, while Stephen wants to knee. Yep. Now the beautiful knee. Goes for the turn. Hard to turn a build like that. Yeah. Daniel's very solid. Yeah. And there's that punch, that counter for the knee. You know, a, a less experienced ref may have given an eight count there. It was, it was a slip, yeah. but very easy to look like it wasn't. Abbas showing his understanding of Muay Thai, which is, a, which is beautiful. You need that in refs. Yep, absolutely. There's another knee from Steven. Because at the end of the day, it's the fighter's safety. We're talking about it it's is, the fighter's yeah. the results, and it's the safety of the fighter. Big kick to the body. Very nice and unanswered as well. Yeah. Ooh. Daniel taking the back, but you know, Steven taking the, getting back to front, front to front. Now the rear That was they nice. are beautiful. That landed clean. Goes with a step up elbow, a bit of a slip, he's on his toes. Big style difference, not a huge experience difference, only a couple of fights difference, but big style difference. Yeah, yep, absolutely. Where that real traditional Thai style. Hook for hook. Going for the knee again, getting clipped. Nice. Keeping the distance there, Stephen's trying to do. Keep his aggressive puncher away. Another great round. Once again, probably coming down to those power knees from Stephen. Yep. Hopefully we'll see a replay of some of those knees. Yeah, those guys at home, if you want to learn how to knee, watch this. I think Stephen did a, a better job there of sort of keeping uh, keeping his opponent at bay, you know, we sort yeah. of found in the first round, Daniel was able to, to close that distance yes. really well, but Stephen did probably a better job of using his teeth that round, we didn't yeah. really see that too much in the first, and I think the the knees were just, just that split second sharper For in the sure. second, I thought. For sure. sustained any real damage. Big right hand. Big right knocks, hand. knocks the head back. Oh, uh, another again. one. Rattled him a little bit. Body kick, unanswered. Nice teep, keeping the distance. Moving forward and punching isn't always the most powerful way, so nice planting your feet. Nice teep. Fighting down the mouth guard, throwing right like that. Hand, yeah. Single, singles over over multiples any day for me. Yeah, good clean body kick yeah. every time. Yeah, good clean body kick. It's one solid hand, maybe you know two. If you're landing solid ones, just follow them up with solid, not just throwing for the sake of throwing. Yep. There's a straight left from Daniel. Lines are home. Beautiful teeth there again from Stephen. Yeah. Another one. Doesn't need to exchange. Doesn't need to get yeah. caught up. Yeah, doing a very good job. Of Another knee. Stephen so playing his game here. Yeah. Very nice. Another knee. Once again, landing with that right hand. Oh, goes for the spinning elbow. Wasn't quite spin there. Spin and a miss. Daniel's still pressing forward, but yeah, it seems Stevens uh, got the answers even when it does go to the clinch. Yeah. Stevens seems the, the, the better of the two. Yeah, he certainly does. I'm 
already having dreams of what the next matchup for the, yeah. the, the <laughs> for the next round's gonna look like. Yeah, amazing. That was a nice step up into a hook. Almost down to the final 30 seconds. Yep. Daniel's still chasing. He is. <laughs> it's not a backward step. Nah. Pushing forward. As happy to run through everything that's been thrown. Yep. Final 30 seconds. Forward momentum on, forcing Stephen back. He's doing a yeah. good job. Stephen is he's keeping that distance, keeping that range. He's just got to be careful he doesn't get caught. Nice teep again. Step through right to the teep. And locks him off to finish the fight. The final bell will go into the moment. There, there we it go. Is. In the books. Once again, went, went three rounds. Got to fight again. Yep, absolutely. Show a sportsmanship from both boys there. Yeah, Muay Thai, mate. Muay Thai. Yep. No talking crap and, and no, no, no resentment after the fight, nah. you know? Nah, for sure. Stephen fought a really good fight there. He had a clear game plan in place, you know, keep yeah. his distance.